Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to fix this problem on your Windows 11 system. In the first step, we need to open services. So search for it and open it. Then search for Windows update. So here it is. Simply right click on it and select properties. Then in the general tab, select startup type as disabled and then click on apply. Then we need to stop the services then click on ok once done close this window then open settings and on this window click on network and internet then select ethernet once we are here just enable this option method connection now close this window now press windows key plus r key together to open run and type in gpedit.msc and click on ok once we are here select standard then from the computer configuration expand administrative templates then expand windows components so let me expand in windows components then expand windows update just scroll down and search for windows update so here it is just expand it then again select standard then click on manage and user experience select standard on the right side select configure automatic updates then right click on it and simply click on edit on this window we need to select enabled then from the options section select second one notify for downloads and auto install then click on apply and then ok now close this window and let's move to the next step simply go to search bar and type in registry editor from the search results click here to open it select s now on this window expand hk local machine then expand software folder now just scroll down and expand policies folder then expand microsoft folder then right click on windows folder we need to create a new value new key and name it as windows update again right click on windows update create a new key and name it as au make sure au is in capital on the right side create a new devote value and name it as no auto update and right click on it select modify and change the value data as one click on ok now restart your system your problem will be solved you are good to go